All right, I'll try to show you the present by Paul Graham. Um, when I say I try to show you, um, I mean that the, the, the book itself, the size and the, the different gatefolds, and you'll see that in just a moment, I'll make it um, a little tricky with my little setup here, my little tripod and my, my Mino camera and everything, but you know, it should work, we'll see. Um, so this is a body of work that everybody was uh, interested in. I got a lot of a lot of people asked me whether I had seen the show and I had to tell them I had not. And then they asked me what I thought of the book and I, I, I had to tell them for quite some time that you know I didn't have the book yet. But so this is it. This is the book and um, so you'll see there's the first gatefold here. <coughs> I'm gonna go through this uh, so at, at the usual pace I suppose. So you get an idea of what the book looks like, um, you know, how it works. You need to clearly need to get your own copy or look at it in person to, you know, have a look at the pictures and to understand the details of what this is all about. So you see this book works with um, different gatefolds that you can sort of see or maybe not see on your computer screen here. Uh, it's all right. You see there's always, not always, but Often there are pairs of images. I just want to talk about one image maybe, but you see uh, hopefully on your computer screen um, that the set of characters is kind of the same. Yeah, there's the same car. And this girl here with the I Heart New York t-shirt. This guy. And then you see in this photograph this woman is in focus and in this photograph this other woman in the background is in focus and she's here. So you see this two, two moments from, uh, you know, this brief period in time. Um, a lot of people asked me what I thought of this. So, um, whatever that might mean. Work is obviously a, a clear reference on, on street photography and I think I'm on record. I looked that up the other day that I'm not the biggest fan of street photography for all kinds of reasons and I know a lot of people are going to get angry at me again and there might be a lot of nasty posts on uh, Flickr but I don't really care but this um, book I think does the right thing it, it investigates the, the trope street photography and it tries to move beyond that in a way. So here's a, a, a triptych. I'm just going to check this in the camera again. You can, you, know, you can actually see this pretty well. See the same person here. And then there's the movement. You see that guy here. Obviously, obviously it's more. Um, you know, you have to look carefully and you, you can't expect to see the whole book in this, this video presentation. Uh, just as a side comment, I personally don't uh, view these presentations as reviews. Um, I think uh, a book review is more than just showing you pictures. That's not the idea of uh, why I do these these presentations. Oh, blimey. Okay, so here's a, a, a gatefold that goes over to the to the other side. I don't want to move the whole book. All right, so you're gonna just be missing this one. Um, a review is, is more than just showing you a photograph, uh, showing you a photo book, and talking about it in this kind of uh, presentational sense. Here, I will uh, definitely write an actual review of this book on my blog. I think one thing that's that's very apparent uh, by now already is that there's a large variety of. Uh, of gatefolds, of ways of presenting two photographs or pairs of photographs. They either present it directly next to each other or there's a gatefold that uh, reveal, reveals one photo after you've seen. Oops, so here's the gatefold again on this other page that you can't really see in this setup here. Um, so the, the gatefold is used to reveal a second photograph later. In this case here you get the second photograph you know, placed right on top of the original one. 
So that's quite a bit of a variety here. Uh, in this case, you see the gatefold photos in the back. I think I like the, the general idea behind this body of work. Um, I like the idea that someone would take the idea of street photography and uh, try to move it. Either move out of it or expand it. You can, you know, decide that for yourself. There's a general because there's also a bunch of very great photographs in this book. I do think in general, and I'm going to say this, uh, you know, now, even though it's going to be part of my review, I suppose, is that I think the the triptychs or the images where there are more than two, I find those a little bit more convincing. Um, after a while of looking, I mean, there's a variety of gatefolds and everything, but after a while, I really get the idea. You know, it's about seeing and focus and what have you, and that's fine. But I don't know whether that's enough for me. But uh, clearly, I need to sort of collect my thoughts and, and write about it. This, this one, I think, is, is rather uh, successful. How does this work? I'm so, so I'm sorry. Uh, it's all these different... The variety of gate folding and everything, uh, I think, after a while makes this book... Oops, so this is on this page, so you can't really see makes this book a slightly tedious affair. I think that's just what happens. I think the the presentation itself could have been slightly simplified, but I'm probably going to catch flag for that. But, you know, whatever. And then there's a third one. And then uh, that's it. So you notice um, this is the book. There's um, basically no text in the book other than right at the beginning. So you basically are made to look, um, make up your mind, understand what's going on, take it in. Um, definitely an interesting book, and uh, I'll, I'll, I'll review this on my blog. Uh, tomorrow or in a week we'll see. Anyway, this is The Present by Paul Graham.